We recently talked about how Liam Hemsworth is dating Miley Cyrus's ex-background dancer, Gabriella Brooks. There are even rumors going around that Liam allegedly cheated on Miley with Gabriella, which explains why people are dragging Liam left and right on social media and why Miley's new song, Flowers, is getting the praise it deserves. Now the question is, are the rumors about Liam cheating actually true? Or is Miley's management team trying to pull a marketing tactic just to promote the song? We're gonna find out the truth in just a minute, but for now, let's address what went down recently between Miley and Liam. In my previous video about Miley, we talked about how Miley and Liam first met and how things escalated between them to the point where they both filed for a divorce after years of trying to stay together. Now, we all know that Miley recently released a new song, Flowers, and to be honest, there have been some accusations going around that Miley allegedly had Easter eggs in her music video to throw shade at her ex-husband, Liam. These accusations came after people noticed a pattern in Miley's new music video after she wore a black suit which allegedly referred to the viral clip of Liam telling her to behave on the red carpet back in 2019. Other than this, people also thought that Miley intentionally released flowers on Liam's birthday, which was the 13th of January. But again, these could all just be speculations. Now, if you go back to my previous video, you know that I addressed all the connections that people made about Miley allegedly shading Liam in her new song and music video. And well, despite some of them being over-exaggerated, a lot of her fans believe that Miley referred to her old Malibu house with Liam that they used to live in before it got ravaged by California wildfires after she said it in her song. We were right till we weren't, built a home and watched it burn. But what made me question this entire drama going around is when news outlets started randomly reporting that Liam once dedicated Bruno Mars' song When I Was Your Man to Miley, which is why Miley's new song, Flowers, seemed to respond directly to that song's lyrics. The reason why I'm questioning all of this, you guys, is because Miley's sister, Brandy, recently spoke up about the rumors going around Flowers being a response to Liam. And despite her stating in the interview that the speculations could be true, she also mentioned that all the narratives fans are making about the situation are making it seem that Miley is a genius. So it's funny because, yeah, the song did come out on his birthday. Was that on purpose? I don't know. Can't say. Genius, though. And the fans, I love Miley fans so much, they go hard in the paint. They go hard in the paint. The fans on TikTok just keep creating narrative after narrative, and it is so funny. It makes Miley seem like an absolute genius and it's just too good. Like every day I wake up to a new one. Like you see, it's up to people whether they believe the whole situation is a PR or not, because even Brandy herself said that this is the best PR that could ever happen because it gets people talking. And well, this turned out to be true because shortly after Miley's fans started all these narratives about the situation, the song Flowers became the fastest song to reach 100 million streams in Spotify history. And y'all, it even debuted at number one on the Billboard Hot 100 with 420 5k sales. To be honest, I'm not even mad about the fans or Miley's team starting this PR behind the scenes because the way this song is doing numbers right now speaks a lot about her dedicated fans. But for the most part, I feel like some of these fans were going way too far with their narratives to the point where the PR stopped working after they continued creating fake accusations about Miley, such as her allegedly dressing like Liam's ex-girlfriend Jennifer Lawrence in her music video. And to make this even worse, some fans even assumed that the house Miley used for her music video was previously owned by Liam to cheat on her with 14 women while they were married. No shade, I don't understand where these fans were getting all this information from, but I guess it was working like magic for Miley because her song was doing wonders and breaking tons of records. Anyways, a couple of days after these speculations started going viral, Liam and his new girlfriend, Gabriella Brooks, were spotted returning home from a romantic weekend getaway in Mexico. And well, despite this being completely awkward considering the fact that they showed up post the release of the song, the paparazzi allegedly confirmed that Liam was showcasing a low profile and trying to dodge them just to avoid any obvious questions about Miley and her song. Even though this could be true, some fans went on social media to point out that Liam could have been avoiding the paps just to hide his girlfriend Gabriella from the public. And the reason why so many fans believe it's true is because of Gabriella's past. In case you missed it, Gabriella used to work for Miley back in 2013 after she was used as a backup dancer for Miley's performances on stage. And as awkward and insane as this is, I feel embarrassed for Liam more than Gabriella because imagine how low you have to be in life to the point where you date your ex-wife's worker.
Now, this isn't the case here, unfortunately, because despite how tragic and awful this actually is, some fans are now accusing Liam of cheating on Miley with Gabriella back in 2019. But thanks to sources, we have evidence that Loki proves it's false. I can't believe I'm defending Liam now, but anyways. As y'all know, both Miley and Liam officially settled the details of their divorce in December 2019. They initially filed in August 2018, but their divorce was not finalized until February 2020. In the meantime, Liam was linking up with Gabriella for the first time after they were photographed together in Australia back in 2019, where he introduced Gabriella to his parents and they were spotted getting the two with the hug. At that moment, everything seemed to be going pretty fast between them because in January 2020, a source told People magazine that Liam and Gabriella were getting serious and that they had spent a lot of time in Australia together, such as exercising, surfing, and relaxing at the beach together. A couple of days later, the couple was spotted in Australia kissing on the beach, and that's how their relationship became official to the public. Again, I feel like the reason why Miley's fans assume that he was cheating on her is because of how quickly he moved on from Miley. Now, no matter what source information we got from this situation, no one really knows what went down behind the scenes between them. But to accuse someone of cheating is a bit of a stretch to me, not gonna lie, and I feel like this whole drama was a way for fans to take revenge on Liam for Miley. Now, what bothers me about this situation is that so many fans are going to Gabriella's Instagram page and leaving a ton of hate comments under her posts, telling her that Miley is better than her and that she is a homewrecker. One fan wrote, Miley is a talented, beautiful, and successful woman. Meanwhile, Liam settled for Miley's ex-backup dancer. It's so funny to me. He finally found what he deserves. Jobless girl with no future and no career. Another one noticed the similarity and said, Liam must really love Miley because he's dating a similar girl. One fan also wrote, Miley always supported you and you cheated with her husband. This is not a good look for you. Miley gave you fame as well as Liam and if it weren't for Miley, both of you guys wouldn't be famous. It's low-key sad to see how fans immediately accept a rumor and start running with it as if it was proven to be true. But for now, we're still waiting for more information about this entire drama. Hopefully, Miley opens up about it in her new album so both her fans and the general public can chill a bit. Anyways, loves, I would love to hear your opinions on this situation down below. Also, don't forget to click on the tab for more videos on these celebs.